this is a victory. And we don't have words to express our gratitude to Barack Obama and all those who have contributed to make this a success. There are a lot of Africans who are here in the city and they have been disconnected with their children, just like other communities. Parents have been deported, even wives have been deported, leaving children with their fathers. So it is a victory to us to have children who are not, docum who are not documented to get the opportunity to work and then their parents also to get the opportunity to be recognized as human beings, you know, as living human beings in America. Because they are living, they breathe air just like any other person. So whatever is good for a, 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 a human being is good for another human being. And um, connecting the children with the family, connecting parents with their children, unifying the family is the root of every human development. You cannot talk about the community or the development of a nation without talking about the family. Every development, any success in a community at the national level starts from the family level. So this is a, a victory to us. And I know we, the African community, are going a mile uh, ahead to make sure that we contribute our quota to this nation. We are not just, um, we are not just enjoying or celebrating this success, but we are also prepared to contribute our quota to the development of America. We are part of the fabric of the country. We are not going anywhere. Our children are here. We even have our children serving in, you know, uh, some positions, you know, leading positions in this country. We have nurses, we have doctors. So we are part of the fabric. We are not going anywhere. And our children are here to stay. And therefore, we are going to make sure that they, they contribute successfully and meaningfully to the development of this nation.